Today we are going to talk about calendar module in Odo. So using calendar module you can see all the plannings. In the case of leave or projects or tasks you can make plannings. If you make some plannings you can see all the plannings date in your calendar. So here is a calendar view and you can see meetings March 8 to 14, 2020. You can see this month wise also and here are some leaves created by Michelle Admin and Antino Oliver. So these things can be seen in the as a calendar view and you can see the attendees here Michelle Admin, Mark Demo, Wood Corner and you can tick this one you can see everybody's calendar and responsible persons can be viewed here. Here you can see Michelle Admin. Then under online appointments, appointments, you can see the online appointments. One is scheduled demo and it is zero scheduled. You can see one. Then you can create new appointments from here. Appointment type, you can give the appointment type and scheduling an activity. You can specify the appointment duration, how much duration. Then at least one hours before or not after 15 days schedule appointment. Okay, this is one hour before. scheduled then you can give the time zone and reminders you can set reminders email three hours before or notification 15 minutes then location can be given in what location then assignation method like random or chosen by the customer then available employees you can specify the available employees okay then their working hours can be seen here then slow okay you can add slot here monday starting hour some hour can be given okay tuesday 8 like that way then questions you can add some questions for this appointment question it can be multi-line text box single line text or it can be radio then available answers can be added here Okay, can add some placeholder then required answer whether this is required answer can save that then messages you can give some appointment introduction some description introduction can be given can save this then here you can see the calendar view and you can see some appointments if it is planned then when you go to website you can see that also and you can publish this appointment in the website Okay. Then under reporting you can see the online appointments and all appointments which can be grouped by my meetings online appointments and grouped by responsible person availability and time ranges can be set then you can see the measures document ID duration based on that you can see the appointments so that's all about this module and thanks for watching. If you are interested in knowing more about this or looking for any Odoo implementation or customization in your business, drop your request to info at cybrosis.com.